Welcome to this video. In this video, I would like to show you how you can set up keys within drop down lists. Enjoy this video and let's get started. So, here we are in the transaction called MyGo to post, for example, goods received for purchase orders. And here we have two drop down lists. One is for the transaction event, and the second one is for the reference document. In this case, we can post a goods received for a purchase order and in here if we're clicking on a one drop down list then we're seeing just the description of the values again and also for the second drop down and within the sap gui options you can set up the keys within the drop down list so once you're logged into the sap system you can click on this customized local layout button in the application toolbar or you could also hit the key combination alt and f12 and then choose options or in the sap logon there you can click in the top left corner and then you can click also options and under interaction design and visualization one there under controls you can select show keys within drop down list so that the keys will show within the drop down list and if you want to you can also select sort by keys within drop down list for more efficient keyboard input I also recommend to select this setting. Then you can click on apply and OK. And if we're calling once again the MyGo, then we're seeing directly the result of this setting because now we're seeing also the keys within drop down lists. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, let me know in the comment section. Please subscribe for this YouTube channel to not miss any upcoming and great videos about interesting facts for SAP ERP and SAP S4HANA. Thank you very much and then see you in the next video.